Anybody happen to know what time it is? Oh, that's right. It's playoff time. I'm Brian Gomez reporting for the Gazette from World Arena where number 19 Colorado College defeated Michigan Tech 2-0 to nothing tonight in the regular season finale, setting up a rematch between the Tigers and the Huskies next weekend in a best of three first round WCHA playoff series, the winner advancing to the WCHA Final Five in St. Paul, Minnesota. It's a series that CC no doubt has to win. The Tigers moved up only one spot tonight to 19th in the pairwise rankings that predict the 16 NCAA tournament qualifiers. So they're still on the outside looking in. CC finished in 5th place in the WCHA. Michigan Tech ended up in 8th. The Tigers have beaten the Huskies 9 out of the last 10 times, only one tie in that stretch. Players and coaches for CC, although they won't say it, they silently have to be happy with the matchup. CC just kind of can control things with Michigan Tech. Even tonight, out there on the Olympic-size ice sheet, when CC was dominated in the first period, they responded with a really strong second, getting a goal from Jaden Schwartz after a goal from Gabe Gensel. And Josh Thornbert was fantastic, making 34 saves, including several key stops down the stretch as Michigan Tech pulled their goalie for an extra attacker. For CC, a sweep this weekend, it's exactly what the doctor ordered. I like the fact we're at home. I like the fact we took fifth and not sixth. I like the fact that we keep our pairwise chance somewhat alive. Um, but all those teams, St. Cloud, you know what? Uh, you get St. Cloud, they have a great goaltender, but, th but they have a very thin, thin bench. You get UNO, they haven't been winning a lot the last four or five weeks, um, but they have really tough forwards. You get TAC, uh, who's got good quickness and good depth of forward with three lines. I mean, it's all kind of the same. I just like the fact that we won two, our first two games in March. You don't see the team all year until March, uh, and then you get them for five straight. But you know what? It, it worked out well for us last year, and we kind of enjoyed it. It kind of gave you that feeling of a, of a junior A best of five series. And, um, you know what? I, I think we knew with a win or a tie we were going to get them. And, uh, you know, we got them. We certainly didn't play very well at times tonight, but uh, Josh was big time, and, and we found a way to win. They're staying out here, and they'll get you know used to the air, and they get used to everything else. So I think that um, it helps them, and it'll certainly help us. I think tonight's game will certainly uh, earn the respect of uh, our players. Will respect them because of the way they compete and play. We were very fortunate to win. Um, but it also gave us a little bit of confidence because we haven't won back-to-back -back games since the middle of December. We shortened the bench. We juggled lines like crazy just to find, find some chemistry. I, you know what? One of the few things I can say that I really liked tonight was that when we did get a power play chance, we took advantage of it. You know what? When we got a five on three, we were confident. It was a great shot. And then, of course, Jaden makes a big time play in the last minute, which is a, which is a big kick in the gut, really, for attack. But um, we just started playing a little bit better. Um, but it was a struggle. We were moving our legs and moving our legs, and it was a struggle, uh, you know, making some skill plays. But, uh, you know, Josh kept us in there and gave us a chance to win. And I thought at times we were pretty good defensively in the third period. You know, it sets us up big for the playoffs. You know, that we got a little confidence. We can get two wins there. And, you know, they're a good team. And, you know, we just kind of scratched and clawed that one out tonight. But, you know, two points is two points, and we got the sweep this weekend, so it was huge for us. They are still fighting for home ice. You know, if they got a win tonight, they could have been sliding that six spot, so we knew they were going to come out hard. Well, they came out in the second, too, really hard, and they pinned us in it for, for a few shifts, but, you know, once we got that, my goal, and then, you know, Jaden, that huge goal late, last minute of the second period, I mean, that kind of gave us some momentum, and, you know, we just kind of stayed on in there. This is the right time to get hot, and, you know, hopefully this will help us in the postseason here, you know. Postseason is the best hockey, so it's always the most fun, so I'm glad we're we're getting on a, roll, a little roll here. We wanted to get that win tonight, um, you know, build some momentum, like you said, um, especially in the playoffs, and especially since we're playing Michigan Tech um, in the playoffs, you know, it proves that we can beat them twice, and we know how to play against them, so that's, that's huge. You know, we knew coming in that they're a good team. You know, they beat some top two teams, you know, Duluth, and they've been in, um, you know, tight games with Minnesota and that, so we knew we couldn't take them lightly. You get to uh, learn to win the greasy ones, because, I mean, playoffs, it, it's a grind, and, and they're not, Pretty games usually. They're you know one goal games or two goal games like it was tonight and last night. So um, 
I mean, there's some things we need to improve on definitely, but it's, you know, two huge points, especially getting fifth place in the standings and not kind of limping our way in with a sixth place home ice advantage. So that was kind of our goal going into uh, this weekend and tonight. I mean, the guys played great defensively in front of me. They, they let me see shots. They blocked all our shots. They cleared out rebounds when I left them there. Um, yeah, I mean, it was, it was a huge team effort tonight, and, and that's what you need coming down the stretch here in the playoffs is, is, a, is a good, solid team effort.